rent yourself one of these skeleton buckets and then you don't have to hand pick rocks anymore. You can just use your shovel, you throw it in there and it catches it. Whew, it is dusty though. I mean, it'll be nice when we're done. We can get in the cab. It's got AC, it's all airtight, it's got AC, but it might take us a couple hours to get all these rocks. Better get to work. Okay, that's actually not how you use it. We're gonna get inside. We're gonna we're gonna dig this place up. This is my new project. This is a new build, and the lawn has not been in yet. It has not been installed yet. It's my job to make this thing into a lawn. So the first step, we gotta get rid of these rocks that are in this lawn because all these rocks, if you put turf down, if you put sod down and you got all these rocks, it's gonna cause some problems in the future. So we gotta get all these rocks out before we can get our irrigation in and then we can get our sod laid. And then this dust bowl will turn into a lawn. It's gonna be awesome. This is my new project. Let's hop in the rig. Let's rake it up. So it's really important to remove all the rock and debris before you lay saw down or even before you seed your lawn. And this skeleton bucket did the trick. As you can see, the gap is about, what would you say that is, six inches? Now it's about two and a half inches is what they told me. So that will remove anything larger than two and a half inches. There's quite a bit of rocks left too, as you can see, any ranging in size. This is what it looked like before I used the skeleton bucket. There's so many rocks here. Giant rocks too. I mean, that was, it was a burn spot in your yard. And this is what it looks like after I used the skeleton bucket. Quite a bit of a difference. So as you saw in the first part of this video, my camera did fall over in the wind and actually cracked my microphone. So I recorded a bunch of stuff at the end of me talking but then I went to look at the video and there was no audio so thank you guys for watching this project has taken me way longer than I thought and probably longer than the homeowner thought but we are getting it done the views of this house though are awesome that's Mount Spokane out there in the distance yeah I'm just pumped to get this thing done I just happened to choose the heat of the summer to do it oh, that's a big one here's a big one Oh yeah, see? Perfect for these big size ones. Look at this. Caught it. Yeah. If 
only there was an easier way.